So it would seem that the creative influence is seeming to take over the Iron Age and people coming out with so many different forms of creativity, whether that be novels, video games, graphic novels, comic books, video games, which I've seen some of those throughout the week. But tonight's video is none of those. And in fact, it happens to be that I was in a musical mood prior to doing this video. But ladies and gentlemen, before we get to that, welcome to What's New Wednesdays. Uh, the title of the video is not going to be What's New Wednesdays because YouTube and their algorithms and screw that. So ladies and gentlemen, welcome to A Drink With Crazy. My name is Royce and I will be your bartender this evening. I hope you are all having something fantastic to drink. I have something mediocre. And it is Bush Light, but without any further ado, let's shout out an Iron Age creator tonight. And it just so happens that I was listening to music and really getting into the mood as a musician myself. So when this got replied to me, I thought, hmm, is this a fortuitous moment of fate? Or will this absolutely eviscerate my channel? We shall find out. You gotta be, you gotta be. You gotta be, you gotta be. You gotta be, you gotta be. You gotta be, Ruth <laughs> Old school thrash metal, Ruthless. This is the Ruthless trailer, a heavy metal audio comic that is uh, coming out by JVP, Mu uh, JVP Music on Twitter. You guys saw him before that. So let's go through this little 44 second audio clip. 43 seconds, 44. YouTube, make up your mind. Good Lord. I absolutely dig. Oh, I absolutely dig the Flying V-style guitar coming up out of the ground. And a heavy metal audio comic. That's going to be quite interesting to see. Look, This is what I'm talking about. Is so many people out there decided that they're done following the mainstream. And they decided that, well, it's time for us to actually create our own things. And the things that they are creating are things that I never would have thought of. And this is, again, I was in a musical mood prior to doing this and I and this popped up and I was like you know what I I feel like this might be fate or destiny or whatever you would like to call it the guiding forces and I thought man oh I just needed to to, to listen to something to get into the mood tonight I'm a little tired and this popped up I love the old school thrash metal, man. Oh, the old school thrash metal. Not a lot of people do it anymore today. Not a lot of people get into thrash metal. But for those of you who are old enough to remember, I am not, but I have the internet. Some of the greatest metal bands of all time were thrash metal when they started hell. I mean, one of the least favorite bands of the world. A lot of people don't realize Nickelback, they did some thrash metal back in the day, too. So... You I mean, you know, it's there. Like Metallica was thrash metal. I know they're corpo. The corpos. I know. I get it. I get it. I get it. But I mean, you think about it, and not a lot of people do the thrash metal anymore. Not a lot of people have the stones to do the thrash metal anymore. I mean, you know, sadly, with the passing of Dimebag Daryl, it seems that thrash metal is just beyond anything that what people can create today. You know, you go back into the days of you know, Pantera, you go back into the days of Metallica, you go back into the days of Megadeth. That was the band I was looking for. That's why I renamed Metallica, because I couldn't remember Megadeth. Because I, <laughs> But again, the thrash metal is something that's just not out there much anymore. So I absolutely dig introducing. Look at this artwork, by the way, too. Look at that. This, If this doesn't encompass just a fantastically awesome scene right here i mean you've got blades on the guitar dudes getting ready to get down in more ways than one a heavy metal oh good lord why oh i like what you did there but let's back up a heavy metal audio comic about one man in a post-apocalyptic world YouTube release quarter four of 2022. Ladies and gentlemen, we are getting very, 
very close to that. Let's see. What do the final seconds hold for us? Oh, it's just a fade to black. But nevertheless, something fantastic to absolutely check out. So right here, we've got JVP Music. Uh, JVP Music. And he is over here on Twitter. So guys, go give him a follow. This is something that really, again, I just found it quite fortuitous that I was in a musical mood. I had the I had the earbuds in. I was listening. I was getting ready for all of this, and I was like, "How are how? What am I going to cover tonight?" There's so many people commenting. There's things that like I'm looking at things. There's a couple things catching my eye, and I scroll down, and then all of a sudden I saw this, and I was like, "Man!" And I was just listening. I was listening. Well, I was listening to a bunch of different stuff, not just metal, but. I listened to quite a few different genres of music, and I thought, you know what? As a musician myself, I am going to reach out the hand and say, good sir, if you are a musician. If you're not a musician and you're lying to me, meh. But if you are a musician, and I feel that you are, and I feel that music speaks to you in probably the way that it does for me, this is going to be a really, really cool audio comic here so the Ruthless trailer is now available. Ruthless is a heavy metal audio comic book that follows one man in a post-apocalyptic world. Narration by Full Blade RPG. Art by Art Attacks. Story and score by yours truly. Good sir. My first contribution to Comics Bake to comics gate and the iron age of media. Sir, well, I do hope that this is not just your first. An only contribution, but I hope that this is the first of many contributions to the storytelling that we need to get back out there and that we need to show so many people. We are more than capable of creating our own stories because guess what? Storytelling goes back as far as humans themselves. We've been telling stories since the dawn of our existence, and that is something that is absolutely forgotten about. It doesn't take anybody special to write a story. It doesn't take a college degree. It doesn't take a high-paying job. It takes a man with an imagination or a man with spirit and the idea that he can simply tell a story that will either captivate or motivate those. And those seems to be the most powerful stories out there. So, ladies and gentlemen, I would strongly suggest that you go over and check out JVP Music and check out his audio comic book and check out his teaser trailer that he set here because that was some good metal. I haven't had I haven't heard some stuff like that in a hot minute. So, for all of those out there who are wondering, what is the Iron Age? Is it just novels? Can I get into it with like this? Can I guess what, guys? People are doing everything. All the Iron Age is, is just a term that says, fuck the corpo medias. We're doing it ourselves now. And that envelops everything. Novels, games, music, graphic novels, comic books, various different stories, animations, movies. That's what the Iron Age is. It is a decentralized network of people getting together and saying, you know what? We're done with you people who have been stealing our money, who have been trying to politically influence you're not allowed to say the brainwashing word our children and we are doing it ourselves and you know what we're gonna do it we're gonna pound that iron and we are going to make sure that when the day comes we are the ones who are remembered in time so ladies and gentlemen i hope that you like this you know What's New Wednesday? Tell me if you like that term. I like What's New Wednesday. I got it from Shadowversity last week when I was hanging out over on the Night's Watch channel. That was pretty fun. And Shad kept saying What's New? And I was like, man, that's, that's a good name. That's a good name for a Wednesday show. So ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for checking this out. And if you liked my video or hated my video, don't forget to comment down below. Because whether you love what I'm doing or hate what I'm doing, I hope with my heart of hearts that you guys go down comment below and let me know what you think because I am absolutely excited every time somebody comments and I make sure to get back to all of you as much as I can in fact I dedicate a special
special Sunday episode to you on Sunday. It's called Sunday Coffee, reading your comments, where I go through, I read all of your comments, and I react to them, and I make sure that if you guys are giving me your time of day, I give you my time of day, and I am very excited for Sunday Coffee. The other thing that I am absolutely excited for is the live show this Friday. is called Iron Age Nights. We are the other side of the coin to Friday Night Tights, where they're over there talking about the old school media and how absolutely trash they are and eviscerating those guys. We're over on Iron Age Nights trying to build up the new media, the new culture, the new new, as it is called by the kids. So ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much. And I look forward to seeing you all next time right here. Cheers, everybody. Thank you all for being here on A Drink With Crazy. If you guys never want to miss a notification for the channel, go down in the link in the description and click that button to follow me and support me over on Locals. It's free to join, but that's where you can support me with money if you so choose. Also, don't forget to click those Rumble and Odyssey links so that way we can get over there and keep that growing. And until next time, cheers, everybody.